Chinese Olympic swimmers are in the hot seat right now because of accusations of doping. Tests conducted in 2021 and 2022 found steroids in the systems of about two dozen athletes, but China said it was only trace amounts and blamed it on food contamination. The World Anti-Doping Agency, aka WADA, accepted their explanation and didn't conduct an independent investigation at the time. But now US lawmakers are pushing for a proper investigation, especially after the latest case in which China blamed tainted hamburgers. And I have to say this investigation begs the question, where's the beef? How could this possibly have happened? This is the third time that they've come up with this lame food contamination excuse. And I think this is the first time I've heard about a hamburger containing anabolic steroids. They've introduced legislation that could withhold up to $3.7 million a year if WADA fails to investigate the positive drug tests. That puts WADA in an awkward position because the US is the single largest contributor to the agency. But why did WADA just accept China's explanation in the first place? According to them, they did their due diligence and initiated an investigation on meat contamination in early 2024. More importantly, WADA is actually claiming the agency is unfairly caught between China and the US as anti-doping gets politicized. At the same time, a claim was made that American Olympic swimmers dodged drug tests while Chinese swimmers were unfairly targeted with multiple tests. This claim was made by a nutritionist for China's national swimming team but the social media post has now been deleted on China's Weibo. RFA's Asia Fact Check Lab investigated the claim and found it to be false. If you'd like to know more, check out RFA's website and search for doping to read up on this story. And don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.